It was 40 years ago that Tony Randall and Jack Klugman ended their five-year run as TV's lovable odd couple. Of course, the show lived on forever in reruns, but now the odd couple is headed back to primetime with Matthew Perry and Thomas Lennon starring in the remake in tonight's big picture, making the odd couple a perfect match once again for primetime. Sometimes we say more with our mouths closed. <laughs> I hear what you're saying, and I don't like your tone. It is tough. It's, this, this role has been played by such talented people, but I'm trying to bring my own thing to it. I'm not doing an imitation. When I was at the lowest point in my life, you took me in, you showed me the true nature of friendship, and I will never forget that! <laughs> what the hell was that? You don't even know how to fight right! I didn't watch rewatch the whole series before we started because I didn't want to just do an impression of Tony Randall. Matthew's wow, connection to Thomas like goes that. way back to when he guest starred on Friends, but Thomas is best known for co-creating and starring in Reno 911. Doing a reboot of The Odd Couple is definitely risky, but new jokes, new era, still two straight guys. Back in the 70s, the network for the original Odd Couple was really concerned that the roommates were being perceived as a gay couple. And uh, now we're gonna finally get to see a bromance. The original ran from 1970 to 1975 and, get this, was never a top 25 hit. When I moved in here, your bathroom was filthy. It would have been condemned by most gas stations. I like filthy. What I hate is you and your habits. In 1993, Tony Randall and Jack Klugman, who lost a vocal cord to throat cancer, told E.T. why it worked. If two people live together, they're going to be in conflict. And also, I realized that I did. Just now, I thought that Oscar, a certain irreverence that Oscar has and a certain conformity that Felix had, and there's that conflict, too. You know, and... Uh, so I guess the kids identify with that. The original show was mostly just Felix and Oscar just, you know, bantering, and it was wonderful. But on this show, we're using uh, the ensemble cast. It's more of an ensemble show. And that includes Perry's real-life ex, Gilmore girl Lauren Graham, playing his TV ex. We do enjoy working together a lot. <laughs> and we have, we have good on-screen chemistry. Mm -hmm. Off-screen, it's... It's just a mess. Yeah. Adorable. <laughs> the main thing that I looked at going into this was, and it's very, very simple, is it funny enough to survive? You just want to make it funny. Thanks, buddy. Here, hold that. Oscar, is that coffee? I just cleaned the rug. Better not move. <laughs> 